we are going now to look to different types of broadcast regarding the order of message delivery. We have seen um, causal order broadcast. We are going to see there are other types of ordering than causal order. And that's, let us look to it now. Let us look to this execution. So, so P1 broadcast a message M1, which is delivered here. P2 broadcast a message M2, which is delivered here. And the message M2 is delivered at P1 and the message M1 is delivered here. If we look to the delivery of these messages, we see that at P1, the delivery of M1 is before M2. M1 is before M2. Whereas at P2, the delivery is M2 before M1. So the question is, is something wrong with this? If we examine the vector clocks carried with a message with a local vector clock, for example, M1 here, this vector clock is less than this vector clock, and therefore it is, you are allowed to deliver the message. The same is for M2. We see there is no problem. In fact, the delivery order here is not the same. So is there something wrong? So that is a question. And the answer is nothing is wrong. In fact, the message M1, we see here, and M2, these two messages are not causally related. And therefore, they can be delivered at any node in arbitrary order. So if we look what are the possible orderings of um, message delivery in broadcast, there are a number of common orderings. We have seen the causal order broadcast. There is also single source FIFO order and there is total order. We just look quickly to these two. So when it comes to FIFO order, messages from the same node are delivered in the order sent. So to say it more exactly, for all messages M1 and M2, for, and for all processes PI and PJ, if PI broadcasts M1 before M2, and if PJ delivers M2, then PJ should deliver M1 before M2, which is basically saying that the order is according to the broadcast order from the source. The order of delivery is according to the broadcast order from the source. And you can see this formulation that we does not require delivery of both messages. We say, we're just talking about the delivery of M2. So what is total order then? So what is total order? So total order, intuitively, total order is every one delivers everything in exact same order. So if we have two messages, M1 and M2, and two processes PI and PJ, if both PI and PJ deliver both messages, if that happens, then the delivery is in the same order. The most important thing is the delivery in the same order. N doesn't matter if it's in a FIFO order or not. So as you can see, again, this formulation does not require delivery of both messages. It just, if they deliver both messages, then are delivered the same order. And the second one, everyone delivers the same order, but it could be very well not in the send order. So let's practice a little bit these different order. So here is an execution. So this is a delivery of message, say, M1 here. This is the delivery of M1. Here is M2. And here is M2. So let us see if this is a single source FIFO. Since we have only a single message from each source, so we can answer this by yes. So is it a total order delivery? Remember, total order means that all nodes deliver in the same order. But you can see here that node A delivers M1 before M2, whereas node B delivers M2 before M1. So the answer is no. Is it a causal order? And we have seen this the answer is yes. So let's look to so this execution. Again, this is a delivery of, we call this a second message. And this is M1, we call this M1, and we call this M2. Okay. So is it a source 5 order? 
you can see that is not the case so the answer is no is it totally ordered the answer is yes we have these two messages in the order m2 m1 but not in a fifo order so total order does not imply fifo order and now the question is it causally ordered now what do you think the answer is no and the reason is clearly because in a causal order implies FIFO order. Remember, one of the properties of causal order is FIFO order. Let's look to this one. Here's again M1, and here is M2. So if this is a FIFO order, the answer is, of course, yes. There is only one message from each source. Is it totally order? The answer is no. Is it uh, causally order? The answer is no. It is not causally order because message M2 is causally after M1, but it is delivered before M1. So you can see very well, at least from this, that FIFO does not imply causal order. We know that FIFO is not comparable in any way to total order. We know that causal order is not comparable in any way to total order, but we know that causal order implies this gave us some kind of hierarchy of, of, of um, broadcast ordering that actually exists except for total order. So total order is something that we will discuss later and it requires more stronger abstraction than what we can do right now. But if we forget about total order right now so we can see what we have is the following. And we use this arrow to say stronger implies weaker order. So here is in this in this relation we have here uniform reliable causal broadcast which implies reliable causal broadcast also uniform reliable causal broadcast implies uniform FIFO which implies just uniform reliable broadcast if we follow from here reliable broadcast implies reliable FIFO which implies reliable broadcast again if we go up there so reliable causal broadcast again um, implies causal best effort which implies FIFO and implies best effort. So this is the hierarchy that we have for for orderings of uh, broadcast. The one that we don't have here is total order. We have seen that total order is not comparable but we can think of a total order that is also causal. We can do that or a total order that is also Five. Okay, this ends now this, the lecture on broadcasts. Later, when we have stronger abstraction in our hand, we will also show how we can implement total order broadcasts, sometimes called atomic broadcasts. So let us continue with the next lecture.